we're going to make an egg braided bread. First of all, I want to give you the recipe, uh, and it is one egg plus one egg yolk. And what you'll want to do is put that actually into a mixing cup. And then add one and seven eighths of water. Four and a half cups of your bread flour, two teaspoons of granulated sugar, one and a half teaspoons of salt, two tablespoons of melted and cooled butter, and one teaspoon of rapid rise active dry yeast. Now you can make it by hand or you can make it in the dough cycle of your bread maker, which I just did. It just just finished, still quite warm to the touch. So I'm going to take the dough out of the container. Get that all out of there. And then I'm going to put some flour on my counter. And I'm just going to actually bring it into like a long oblong. And then with a serrated knife, I'm just going to cut it equally in two pieces in half. And separate them. And then I'm just going to stretch them out, round off the edges. Now this ba uh, bread is going to be baked at 425 degrees, anywhere from 18 to 22 to even to 25 minutes, because all ovens set up differently. So start checking it after about 15 minutes. Now once you do that, I'll stretch it out a little bit longer and I'm going to narrow them in a little bit make them skinnier and then I'm just going to wrap them over and braid it just by bringing the sides over and then I'm just going to pinch the ends so when it bakes it doesn't come apart. So I'm just going to twist the ends. Now what you're going to need is a heavily greased uh, baking sheet or pan and just lay that on top of that. And then I like to put a towel over it till the dough doubles in size. And that can take you up to even up to an hour or so uh, till it doubles. Once it does, again, remember you're going to put it in an oven of 425 uh, degrees. Now, once you do that and it doubles in size, you're going to have actually um, a white of the egg left over. So what you're going to do is you're going to use that egg white with a pastry brush. And you're going to take that egg white and just brush all the loaf with it. Now you can put sesame seeds on this or poppy seeds or just leave it plain. But you'll have that one egg, uh, egg uh, white left over because the recipe, remember, is one egg, one full egg, and one yolk. So use up that white for that. And then I'm just going to sprinkle some sesame seeds on it, all over it. And again, keep it in a warm spot and then cover it with the towel till it doubles, which is usually about an hour. Now, once you bake it, it's going to come out and look like this. You have a beautiful egg loaf braided bread. 
It's very light. It's a moist texture, a very creamy texture to the, uh, to the dough, to the bread. Give this one a try. I hope you like it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think. Thanks for watching, and please subscribe.